Research misconduct, plagiarism, and self plagiarism. While conducting academic research, if one excessively uses the ideas or concepts of others without proper citing, it may result in suspicious plagiarism and self plagiarism. In Chinese, Chao Xi and Piao Tie are similar concepts. Chao Xi refers to copying or passing off others' work as your own, while Piao Tie refers to stealing others' work or property as your own. Either way, both behaviors are considered illegal and unethical behaviors. If you steal or copy others' ideas, procedures, results, or use others' words, charts, of the course of your research without proper citation, it may result in research misconduct. Self-plagiarism means when you use the same results more than once, and letting the readers believe that the information is new and only used in this article. If you wish to use information or research you have published previously. Quoting Paraphrasing Or summarizing Are the most ideal academic writing skills in this situation. Compared to plagiarism, the judgment criteria for self-plagiarism are more unclear, but there are some ways to tell. For example, duplicate publication, data fragmentation, data augmentation, text recycling, or academic self-plagiarism. When researchers are using one's own published work or text, they must inform the readers that these results have already been published and are not new ideas. When researchers are using others' published work or text, they must clearly state its origin and should use their own words to interpret the content appropriately. Doing all of the above will allow the public to trust research results as well as helping academia make progress.